Hey y'all, it's me, Mason. I'm back with a bikini try on haul. So this is the first bikini. It's for my mom says that it fits me probably the best out of all my bikinis. I just, this was the first one that I put on. Okay, so the place that I got this from is called Southern Exposure in Fenwick, which is I don't even know if it's in Delaware or Maryland, but I probably should know that. Got like a Hunza bikini there. Those are trending right now, so you probably know what I'm talking about. But if you don't, like look up Hunza, they're like $200, but I think that they go on sale. And I got like a bunch of bikinis last summer. I got the Hunza, but my mom's using it because it fits her too. So yeah. Moving on, I also got at the same store, um, what was it, Southern, Southern Express, and it, I don't know if it came with it or I just picked it out. I think that I just picked it out because it matches so perfectly. I mean, it could be from first set, but I just really don't think that it was. But, like, how cute is this? Like, you could take this on a boat and you will be fine, like if you got cold it is so cute oh my goodness that is so cute i cannot like i just i'm so cuted out right now i love it next one billabong this is a showstopper like it is so cute it just makes me want to dance around this should have been if i was in the pool on my birthday this would be my birthday bathing suit. I think actually this is my favorite bathing suit. Like, it's just so freaking adorable. Oh my gosh. Ladies and gentlemen, hello. Nice to meet you. I am the sexiest bathing suit, most beautiful in the world. And you can't even say that it's not a one piece. So, girls, I mean, if you're trying to like look cute, billabong they just they're probably number one for me or manji can't really decide they're tied this next one is from billabong this is probably my favorite bathing suit that i have and i have to stand on my tippy toes so if i look wobbly that's why i still haven't figured out the perfect tripod position but anyway we're working with what we got being resourceful enough but yeah, Billabong, I mean, it's a 10 out of 10 bikini. It covers everything that I want it to. You know, sometimes you get like a bathing from Shein or something. It's like doesn't cover like right here. You know what I mean? But maybe I just pick out the skimpy ones or something. I don't know. I tried to look at the reviews or whatever, but then I get it and I'm just like, whoa, that's not what I expected and I cannot even wear them to the beach or they'll like fall off or something. This is so secure. Nothing's going to pop out. Perfect bathing suit. If you're wondering how much these are, they are on the expensive side, but I'll really only ball out for some bikinis. Um, you know, besides like shoes or designer things, but this is about bikinis and I'm saying like maybe it was I know I got this on sale it was like maybe 20 and 20. And then everything else was probably like at least $20 a piece, like the top and bottom. But it is definitely worth the money. You'll have them for years. Just thought that I would show proof of a bathing suit that I've had for at least six years. And it's Billabong. You can see on the back. And it covers just as much as the other one. If anything, it even fits better because of how many times I've worn it. And I love the top. This pattern I know was super popular they would put maybe black instead of pink but these flowers like i remember seeing them on dresses and stuff because the time i got this it was my first job ever at quiet storm and they have like a girl section that is so cute you know when you go into a surf shop you don't even have that aesthetic and then you walk out of there with like a whole nother closet but you're like you know what i mean i live at the beach so i have so many different personalities when it comes to clothes <laughs> like this one I haven't really worn it but every time I put it on I'm like oh my god it's so cute but you know I feel preppy in this 
like a southern girl but usually my bathing suits now are like the checkered one and you know less flower and more like in your face if that even makes sense I, i'm so bad at explaining what i figured thinking. out what i was trying to say and that's basically like i probably wouldn't buy that pattern right now anymore like i think it's cute and i understand why i buy it but do you ever look at the stuff in your closet you're like i would not buy this now but yeah so this one is maji and maji is something then and now i will always buy me some maji so this is the one side of it and you know how they're reversible it's like well it makes spending the money even easier because it's basically like two tops and two bottoms because they're reversible and nobody would even know that they're two different bathing suits food for thought well everybody knows that <laughs> yeah like it's so cute covers everything it's so soft and like buttery smooth so i'll show you the other side now i don't know if maji is falling off or what but hopefully you guys already know about them so here it is i love this so much i love both sides i just can't get enough of it oh my goodness i'm so excited to wear this it's from k coast a local surf shop i love it and it will protect me from the sun because well i should have worn it but i already got sunburned so i probably am gonna be fine now but i just love it ah! and it makes me want to go surfing or something but I feel ugly right now because, like, I'm not... Well, actually, it looks good. It looks really good. Okay, so next thing. All right, and now on to this beautiful bathing suit. My tan line makes it look a little weird, but from afar, it's not that bad. Um, This one is from Aerie. A-E-R-I-E. -E. And I didn't put this on in my Aerie haul so I'm just gonna do it now in case you wanted to see but definitely one of my favorite bathing suits um I think it was only $14 but honestly it kind of is like Walmart material but I'm not saying Walmart is bad because this bathing suit is honestly great I have no complaints besides it just feels like a Walmart bathing suit like you can tell that the other ones that are more expensive are better quality but I think this will last you just as long if you take care of it all right we're just gonna keep on hyping up billabong um these are my favorite cheeky 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 um bathing suit bikini pants this is tori praver t-o-r-i-p-r-a-v-e-r -E for the top also from southern express the top and then these are from billabong I think they, I might have gotten these at Southern Express. They carry the best bathing suits. I'm pretty sure you can get them online. And I'm literally so sorry if you cannot get them online. But that's why I'm just trying to find the brand. But a lot of them, like, I just snipped off because I wanted to wear them and not be, like, itchy. So, another one, adorable. And if you can't see what it is, they're like little palm trees. Solid and Striped is this next brand. Um, I love these so much. They have a little belt on them. How adorable is that? They remind me of like Lifeguard in LA. Like pink striped umbrellas and pink everything. And then a pool. Like in my perfect world in my house in LA where everything is pink. I would be wearing these every day with my little pink top. Yeah, that's my dream. <laughs> so these don't match, which is kind of annoying me, but they're cute, right? Also, they're from Southern Express, but I gave you the brand too. This is the extra small. I honestly might have to edit this out because this is what I'm talking about when you get bikinis from AliExpress or Shein. Like, I think Shein honestly is better than AliExpress. I'm never getting bathing suits off AliExpress ever again. I had a phase where I loved AliExpress because you could get like anything and any like accessory belts, 
earrings, necklaces, bathing suits, you know, like Romwe and stuff like that. Like, I'm sorry, but who is, is, uh, not showing? Am I like the back? Oh, oh my God. I think I just flashed my butt. Okay. So yeah, like this, you can't wear this to the beach because one gust of wind is going to like mess what you've got going. It's just like a little too, I don't want anybody to see my, you know, like the hair, like it's, it's, it's cutting it too close. Like this is what I'm trying to say, but it's still cute. Like I love the pattern. Don't get me wrong. It's super cute, but I don't know. This last one is my wedding dress. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but it would be a nice top to a wedding dress. Um, it's from the brand Becca, B-E-C-C-A. And I don't know why I always say and like that in my videos. I don't even really talk like that, I don't think, but maybe I just don't realize it. But anyway, I mean, like I don't even need to explain it because I feel like obviously you see the detail and the craftsmanship into this. It's just so adorable. I know what I'm wearing when I get married, in the pool at least. But yeah, thanks for watching this video. I really appreciate every single one of you. If you're new, comment below. I want to know who is new or if you're a returning viewer, comment if you're a returning viewer and I will be happy. So yeah, um, I have a bunch of other haul ideas coming up, but if you haven't seen my previous videos, go and watch that. And I'm so grateful for each and every one of you watching my videos and keep watching them and I'll keep making them. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much.